What's going on everybody? James Alabama here at the Hoop Group. We're here at Future All-American Camp, our last camp of the summer here at Albright College. We're sitting here with Jonathan Cabongo, a 2018 guard from Huntington Prep. Jonathan, how's everything going? Everything's going good. Uh, it's day three of Future All-American Camp. Tell us a little bit how camp's been for you so far. Camp's been good. Uh, it's a tough day three today. Some tough losses. Day one and day two were, were pretty good, but I mean, it'd be it'd make it a little bit better if my team would win a little bit more games. You know? Still got you know a couple games left, and then obviously the All Star games and stuff tomorrow, which we look forward to seeing you in. Uh, tell us a little bit about the competition out there. What, what's it been like? The competition's good. You know, it's a good environment to work on things um, that you need to improve on in your game. You know, so I'm just taking advantage of it, and you know, just going hard every single game and every single quarter. Really, really testing yourself a little bit. Uh, you played this uh, past summer with Canada Elite yeah. for AAU. Well, how was your uh, summer season? It was good. Uh, we came short in a couple tournaments that I think we should have that we that I think we should have won. But I mean, it was our first team. It was our first summer together. So I think that as years pass, you know, we'll get better at playing with each other. And we'll probably you know end up winning the association. We 17, so. Guys, definitely built a platform for you to grow in the coming years. That's great. Uh, let's flip over to high school a little bit. You're going to be a hunting prep again for your second year. Talk a little bit about your expectations for the coming season. Um, I'm just expecting to, I expect for myself to just contribute a little bit more. You know, I contributed a little bit last year, but I think this year I'm going to have a bigger role. So, you know, just being ready to contribute and help my team win the ch national championship. What's something that you're maybe working on, you know, later to August and September, personally to up your game, bring it to the next level, to help Huntington, to help Canada lead? And, you know. I think the next step for me is just keeping a motor every single like position of the game, just taking no plays off. I think if I could do that, I could, I could really separate myself. Can't really argue with that. With your skill set, always going. Talk about your recruiting a little bit. Where is it at? I know you have a few offers, but where is your, you know, interest level at? Uh, I don't have. I don't know about my interests. I might have some, but I, I don't ask my. I don't really ask my coaches. I try not to pay attention to that. I just try to pay attention to working on my game and getting better. Cause really and truly, I haven't done anything yet. You know, so my main focus is just getting better every day. You still got a lot of ways to go in your high school career. Obviously, that's a great, great mindset to take. Last question for you. Uh, you know, I know you know your brother, Mike. Won, was in the TBT tournament this past uh, summer. Yeah. He won with his team overseas elite. Have you been able to talk to him at all about it? I did talk to him. He's very excited. You know, it was a good thing for him. With all the ups and downs he's been through in his career lately, it's just a good tournament for him to win. You know, for his for his confidence and stuff like that. So you know, I'm just happy for him. Definitely a good feeling for him. Have to be a good feeling for you. And hopefully, you finish the next two days of this camp strong. We look forward to seeing you. You know, in the future. Sorry.